welcome back family welcome back to my home i am back home um now you saw my last videos i believe i was on vacation what a wonderful time we had um the hubs and i had an awesome time in pr um i came back about a week ago and I've just been playing catch up, catch up in the house and catch up at home. So, sorry about this. If you heard the notification. Um, <clears throat> so, yeah, I've been kind of busy at work and, and at home and stuff. And, and, you know, I had to come back home to uh, landscaping and stuff like that. And cleaning up because, you know, I, I did a little bit. And just prepping the home for summertime, you know, and barbecue. That's what I've been doing. So I just wanted to share. So today's video is going to be on the semi semi annual sale that um, Bath and Body Works had. So Bath and Body Works had their semi annual sale. I think it was last week. I don't know if I see. I seem dark, but anyway. Um. They had their semi-annual sale and the three, so they had a couple of things on sale. So the three wick candles, <clears throat> excuse me, were for, I think, $12.95. And I know that they go lower than that because they usually bring them down to about eight bucks. Um, I think that's around September-ish, um, but I needed candles anyway, so I racked up. Um, so I bought a couple of candles and I think they're, um, they had a few things on sale. Uh, hand soaps, I think were also on sale. The wool flower, um, refills were also on sale and I got a couple of those. I think that's all I got with the three wicks and the, um, and the, uh, wool flower refills. So let's just dive right into it. I've missed you guys. I know it's been, it's been a little bit. Um, so I just opened the box and I think I got around six, seven candles. So there's some new ones here that I've never tried. So these are new scents that I've never, that I've never tried, but I thought I would give them a shot like this one. And I saw a couple of, um, you guys review, um, these, this scent, and this is the white caramel cold brew and the packaging looks like this. Of course, I love the black cover. It's my favorite part. But it's the cold brew and it's white and it smells like a cafe. It smells like a cafe. Yeah, this smells really, really good. And it's a vanilla sweet cream with warm caramel drizzle. That's exactly what it smells like, vanilla. So I got that one. Um, well, I also got a coupon. So the next one is, this is Summer Boardwalk. And this year's Summer Boardwalk looks like that. And this is, this is an old, this is an older scent. It smells really good. It smells like summertime on a boardwalk, like a hot summer day. And then you smell like, um, it smells like caramel popcorn or like popcorn. You smell like popcorn in the background. So this is really nice. And the tin is silver. So I got that one. Um, I also received, let's see, let's see, the San Francisco, what is this? Oh, this is um, Endless Weekend, but this is a new packaging because I purchased uh, Endless Weekend before and the packaging never looked like that. Look how pretty that looks. Isn't that pretty? It's really nice, really nice scent too, this Endless Weekend. This is my youngest daughter's favorite, um, I think one of her favorite scents too. So it's kind of perfumey. Let's see what this says, what notes. This is Fresh Summer Mandarin Sun-Kissed uh, Magnolia Blue Coconut Water with Essential Oils. So that's nice. Um, the next one is, oh, I've, purchased this one before <clears throat> and I've also hauled this one before too because this is one of my favorite this is hot cocoa cream this smells like hot chocolate in a jar seriously this is this smells delicious like rich hot chocolate in a jar okay 
the next one is I, and I just love the packaging on this one because I want to put this one on in my living room. And this is the um, Gardenia, no, gar, I'm sorry, Garden Greenery. Hmm, never smelled that one before. It's all right. The packaging is very pretty. Look at that. It's got flowers all around it. See? And the black cover. And it's white in color. And it smells very fruity. Let's see what the notes are in this one. So this is sweet apricot. Yeah, that's what that's what I'm smelling. And fresh basil, bright mint leaves with essential oils. So that's it's really refreshing though. Yeah, this smells really, really nice. It's really refreshing. That's nice for the living room. Um, this is the second to last one. This is French baguette. I've never tried this, but I've heard a lot of good stories about this. Good stories. <laughs> mm. It smells like a bakery. Yeah, it smells all right. The packaging is mm, it's very simple. It's clear. And, um, and the silver top. And it's white in color. And it smells like, like a bread. <laughs> like, like a bread in a jar. Um, this is slow rising dough, crisp crust, and a pat of butter. Yeah, it kind of smells like that. It kind of does. It smells like Italian bread. This is nice to have in the kitchen. I like that. It's all right. I don't think that's one of my favorites though, but it was worth a try. And this is the last one. The last one is, and the packaging in this one is so pretty. This is bow ties and bourbon. I've heard a lot of good things about this one too. Well, let me show you the packaging first. Isn't that pretty? So it's purple. I don't know how it's showing up, but it's this camera is not doing anything for it. But it's purple and green. Isn't that pretty? Look at the flowers and the silver top. Oh, this is pretty. This smells perfumey. So let me see the notes. So this is mint. No, fresh, I'm sorry, fresh bergamot, a uh, splash of citrus, and a hint of bourbon. Yeah. We don't really smell the bourbon, but it smells like a men's cologne in the background. It smells really nice. I really like that. That's pretty. And I think that's it. That's it for the candles. Is that it for the candles? Let me see. Did I show you this one? Yeah, this is a summer bottle. All right. So I just purchased that, I mean those, and now for the plugins, I needed refills, so I got the bow ties and, oops, sorry, the bow ties and bourbon in the refill as well. So I got that one, and that's blue in color. Um, I ordered the eucalyptus mint, I, I absolutely love that, and that will fill a room with really nice with a really nice scent this is this one is pretty powerful yeah that's why i like it for certain rooms so that's the eucalyptus mint then i also ordered the sweet tiramisu i'm really interested in trying that sweet tiramisu and it's like yellow in color because i love some tiramisu so i'm really interested in seeing what that one smells like um, I also ordered the mahogany teakwood. I've ordered this one before and I really like this for the downstairs bathroom. I really like that scent a lot. It's very masculine. And then I ordered the mango dragon fruit. I've never tried this one before. I have no idea what it smells like, but I am really interested in trying that out. Because I'm not really crazy about the fruity scents. I like more um, musk and masculine, you know. Uh, or if not then like eucalyptus and fresh so i'm not i don't really gear towards the fruit but i figured i'd give this a try this mango dragon fruit and that's it for the plugins then i also ordered because my car needs a new one um the refill for the um for that that wallflower pocket thingy um, that, that i hang from my visor so i ordered the aloha kiwi passion fruit and that's for the car I think I've I've hold the holder before so so really interested in seeing what that one smells like but I need a new one so and that's it 
So I will see you guys in the next one. I also have my Grove to do because a friend asked me to um, upload my Grove haul. So I will be doing that shortly, if not right after. So if you see me wearing the same stuff in the same spot, that's what that means. All right. It's good being back. I miss you all. I hugged a palm tree for Lisa Fry. I did. She asked me to hug a palm tree in Puerto Rico. I did, honey. I did. I wanted to hug them all because I did not want to leave. And I made a wish for Miss Linda. I made a wish in that sunset. I made a couple of wishes, but I made one for you, honey. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. All right, take care.